Hey everybody, I hope you're doing well today. For my next music ministry song, I'm going to do Will the Circle Be Unbroken on uh, diatonic mountain dulcimer in DAA tuning. Okay, so uh, I'll go through the song, I'll play it for you, and I'll talk you through it step by step. I'm not going to give you tabs for it. You need to learn uh, how to follow someone and um, play along. And you'll learn it much better that way. At least I believe that. So uh, anyway, I hope you enjoy this. If you want to check out my other free music ministry songs on different instruments and all that stuff, I'll put the link uh, for it down below in the description. And uh, I just hope you enjoy this lesson. All right, go ahead and tune DAA for me. Your middle and your melody are both the same A note. And what I'm going to do here is I'm going to play it through several times and I'll sing a verse chorus for you as well. And I just want you to listen and watch what I'm doing, okay? This song is not hard to learn. It's very easy because the verse and the chorus are both played the same, okay? You can do this. I'm going to do back strumming, um, but I'm also going to play through it for you uh, with just out strums as well, okay? So that you can... Um, Learn how to do that, all right? So here we go. So you can see it doesn't go but to the seventh fret. That's as high as it goes, okay? So you can do this. All right. Let me now just play it through slowly, all out strums, okay? And then we'll take it section by section. Here we go. just all out strum kind of quarter notes there um all right so for the first section um uh, it goes like this okay and that's oh one three O oh, one three, five four three, five. Now I'm gonna do it with back strumming. Okay. 
Now I'm going to do it again and you can do it with me. If you aren't here yet, 013-5435, if you aren't here yet, just stop it and practice that a little bit. Okay? Here we go. One, two, ready, go. Okay, let's do it again. One, two, ready, go. Now, if you're thinking about singing it, this is what you would sing there. I was standing by my window. Okay. If I put a little more speed on it, it would be I was standing by my window. Okay. So pause it there until you get that part. The next part goes like this. Okay. If I'm just all out strumming. Five, four, three, three, four, three, three. One, one, open. One, open. Okay. Again. Five, four. with back strums. Okay, now let's play that together. Here we go, slowly. One, two, ready, go. So this would be, um, if we sung this, this would be, uh, I, so I was standing by my window. Now our part. On a cold and cloudy day. Okay. On a Um, the next part. Okay. So that starts. Oh, one, three, 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 five, seven, seven, five. Okay. Oh, one, three, five, seven, seven. All out strums. We do that again and count us in. One, two, ready, go. Okay, so if we were singing that part, it would be when I saw that first come rolling. Okay. One more time. One, two, ready, go. Okay. Last part. Goes like this. And if I were singing that, it would go like this. For to carry my mother away. All out. 
without strumming would be like this. Now, if you're um, counting every strum I do, I would advise against that because sometimes I'm playing half notes, sometimes I'm playing quarter notes. You need to listen and feel it, okay? I know you can do this if you just take your time and think about it, okay? So that's the whole song. Um, so now what I'm gonna do, play through it slowly several times. After you've practiced it a bit, see if you can play along with me. Okay, here we go. One, two, ready, go. Okay, now I'm going to play it a little faster. You may not be able to keep up with this. Uh, what I suggest you do, if you can keep up with the slow one, try this. Just try out strums every once in a while. Okay, you could do that, right, to, to keep up with what I'm doing. So uh, I just want to play it through a couple more times. And uh, I want to do it a little faster. Here we go. Uh, a little intro for this would just be... It would just be strumming, right? And then first fret and then open, right? And then we would start. So I'm going to do that little intro here too. All right, here we go. I do hope you enjoyed that free lesson. I hope you'll take the time and uh, effort to learn it, play it for others, maybe teach somebody else how to play it. And um, yeah, before I go, I always want to remind you that Jesus loves you. Bye-bye, y'all.